YouTube, it is your boy, Crypto Kwame. We are back with another video, man. Today, we're gonna be creating a landing page with glitch.com. Without further ado, let's just jump right into it. So, I wanna show you guys what I've done so far. I was able to change the background, put my uh, headshot in there, and just change the title of it. And we're gonna, what we're gonna do is we're gonna change these links to go to our word. YouTube channel and our live web page that we deployed on GitHub. So I do want to show you guys how I was able to change the background and the head headshot. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the rewind tool and glitch just to take us back. And I'm just going to redo all the code so you guys can know how to do this. So <clears throat> what you do is you go to glitch.com and you're going to go to glitch in bio. So once you get that, um, they're going to give you this template. So now with this template, it's going to have a bunch of files for you. You have a whole bunch of JSON files, as you can see here. Um, if you go to the Publics tab, we have a bunch of styles and then themes. And we have a bunch of CSS files. And what you can actually do is change the theme of this in your JSON file. So everything is done in the settings.json file. So right now, let me show you guys how we're just going to change this right here. I'm gonna change the name to what subscribe to so bam as you can see live changes we change the uh, title of it to subscribe to crypto Quam. now what we're gonna do is change the avatar so to do that what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to assets and you're going to upload an asset and that's gonna open up uh, just your finder if you're using Mac and you can pick any assets right now. I wanna use this headshot here. What I'm gonna do is upload this headshot right here. And it's uploading as an asset. So boom, we have our headshot. What we're gonna do is we're gonna click it. We're gonna copy this link. So once we copy this link, we're back to the settings.json page. And right here you can see avatar image. This is the URL to the glitch avatar image. All we have to do, guys, is bam, we're gonna cut it and paste our own image link, and bam, we have Crypto Qualms headshot. I really don't like this picture, but hey, for the video, we're gonna leave it there. So, next, I wanna change the background. So, to do that, what we're gonna have to do is go into the CSS files. So, for what you wanna notice here is that, unlike an HTML page, this is a JSON file. So how they link the style page is with this theme right here. So the theme is going to be glitch. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the themes. We're gonna find glitch. And now we can make our changes. So the font face, we wanna leave that the same. The root, we're gonna, and the, and the root is where we're going to make our changes. So I wanna make a background image for our background. Instead of just a gradient or a color, I want to use a background image. So right here I have this CSS for a background image. I just went to developer mozilla.org. Um, I actually just looked up CSS background and bam. So we're going to copy that. We are going to go back to the code editor and we're going to make this background image and URL. So as you can see, the URL is of a Mozilla Firefox. We don't want that. We want our own URL. So I wanted to use kind of a retro background. So what I did was I just looked up retro 80s neon GIF and I found this one. I'm gonna just download it to our desktop. Okay, so once that's downloaded to our desktop, we go back to assets. We are going to go upload an asset and it's titled giphy.gif right here. And bam, we have that uploaded as an asset. We're gonna copy the link. So unlike the headshot, which we um, edited in the JSON file, the background, we're actually <clears throat> going to edit that in the CSS file. So glitch.css, we paste our URL. And bam, let's go live and see what this background looks like. So bam, we have our background. We do wanna, I wanna resize it so it's uh, the full length of the background. So we're gonna use the background size CSS tag. Gonna put that right under here, right under background image. We're gonna go background size, 
and we're just gonna play with the size. So that's 100. I wanna go 104,000 pixels, 1,400 pixels, and then 1,000 pixels, and let's see what that looks like. It's uploading, and bam, as you can see, we have our image right here. We have the length and the height of the image, and it looks a lot cleaner than just the previous background image. Let's see if we can make the height a little bit, um, height and width, width. width. Dude, that looks so clean, guys. Looks very clean. In my honest opinion. Next thing we want to do is I want to get rid of this footer at the bottom. I think this footer looks very out of place. So we're just going to delete that. Alright, we go to the index.html file to delete that footer. It is going to be right here. So bam, all we have to do is delete that. And the footer should be gone. Yeah, the footer's gone. It looks a lot more clean. So now we're going to add our links at the very bottom. That's what I want to do. So to do that, we go to settings.json. And first, I want to add my glitch.com link. Okay, so we added all of our links in here. We have our glitch. Uh, we have our GitHub account, our Instagram, our LinkedIn, our SoundCloud and our YouTube. We don't have a Twitter, but I'm just gonna leave that in there. Um, and uh, if you have any other um, links that you wanna put in here, Twitter, your Tumblr, your TikTok, if you're a content creator, you can put all of those links in here. I also was able to put my YouTube channel there and my email. So now I wanna change these two big buttons and I just want them to say, one of them I want them to go to my live website. So. We're going to change the text right here to the first box slash button. We're going to change it. And the text is going to be you my website. So, bam. That's, there's a new button. Our GitHub website, I actually have the link ready. We're gonna put that GitHub website link in there. All right guys, and we're gonna paste that link right here. View my deployed website on GitHub. Content is blocked, why is it bullshit in? Bam, as you can see, it takes us to our deployed website on GitHub. Super sick. Let's change the second button. Uh, let's make it take us to our YouTube channel. So we're gonna change the text to say, help me get to 10K subscribers. And we're gonna link my YouTube channel. Bam. So we have view my website deployed on GitHub. Help me get to 10K subscribers. And built by Glitch. I'm gonna leave that there so people can go to Glitch if they wanna understand, view my live website. And without further ado, man, that is how you build your own personal landing page on Glitch. I will link this. Um, website in the URL of this in the description of the video and without further ado I'm out no fun sorry my show afterwards bro said it was a go so I'm trying to take her home yeah I'm trying to take her home in the order she keep looking at my phone she said are you Mr.